about so, but this could be the very first video footage of this town. I've been searching around and there's very few pictures, very little information about it, and no sign of the city yet. So we came out here on a nice little four mile hike, descend all the way down just to find this remaining town. What's well, still left, as you can see. I mean, this building's pretty much trash, but it's a sign of what's still standing. A guy bought out the land and is holding this place as a reservation, or he's been serving it for, so people like us can come down here and still see what's left of uh, our past. It's pretty interesting, though. I mean, these old houses, there's an old railway system down here. I don't know if it's like that building over there, but uh, there's a bridge, and the bridge is pretty much washed away. Well, we're going to go take a peek through the, to this cabin. We couldn't get it on camera. Uh, we had to cross half the bridge. It was a little sketchy. We made it across, but we got some pictures and stuff. We made it to the building over there, and then we followed down the road to the mines. Uh, just some prospects, nothing really serious down there. I think the really serious mine that was in this area was the Crossens mine that's behind the uh, cabin. Otherwise, yeah. A little, a little different. Tied a rope to each other, scooted across the uh, old beam that was just lying across the river. Now we made it back to our gear and we're just sitting here trying to recoup ourselves. This is the old crossings mine. I don't know what their stories really are, but apparently they uh, blasted uh, shut. Outlaws stole the gold and blew it shut. So, that's that.